It's already burned homes and thousands of acres of land. Firefighters work furiously today to try and contain the TRE fire. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Bill Frank Moore. And I'm Melissa Carlson. Thanks for joining us this midday from the ground, from the air. Hundreds of firefighters have converged on the small community of Topaz Ranch Estates in Douglas County to battle a major wildfire there. That's right. News 4's Dina Cuffer has been on the front line since early this morning. She joins us now live with the very latest. Dina? Bill, the latest numbers released by the East Fork Fire District say that 6,600 acres have now burned in the TRE fire, and it still remains at just 10% containment. Now, a preliminary investigation reveals that the fire may have been started 2 o'clock yesterday by a private residential burn. They actually put the, the uh, burn out, and then it rekindled, is what Douglas County investigators are saying. Two homes were lost in this fire so far, and we did get a chance to go up to the property today where one of those homes won. Stood. It's a very devastating sight to see. We met a woman who lives very close across the street who, as you can imagine, feels blessed that her home is still standing. Before I even got out of bed yesterday morning, I had a prayer. I said a prayer to myself asking, asking Heavenly Father to please protect me and the property today. Betty Rabejo's home on Sandstone Drive was spared by the through the Topaz Ranch Estates. Unfortunately, the home across the street wouldn't be so lucky. Betty tells me a family from Southern California uses this home as their summer vacation spot, and it was Betty who had to tell them their summer home was gone. I called them and let them know that their place is no longer there. What did they say? Oh, Mr. Johnson, he's really cool, you know. And it's meant to be, it's meant to be. We're here on Slate Drive, and this is where the fire is believed to have started. You can see right here on this hillside, and then it quickly spread all the way through this valley, burning up all those junipers here in the Topaz Ranch Estates. Do you feel lucky that your home is standing, but the one literally yards, hundreds of yards away is, is gone? You bet. Look at me. <laughs> I'm still standing. Certainly a very emotional day here for many people in this community yesterday and today. Now more than 500 firefighters are continuing to tackle this blaze from the air and the ground. And now the concerns have shifted to the Smith Valley area. This fire is moving to the northeast. So now fire crews are really trying to buckle down on getting the fire lines contained in that area. We want to let you know, though, that no roads have been closed. And fire crews are going to do their best to get in to protect further communities from any harm happening. Reporting live here in Wellington, I'm Dina Kupfer. I'll send it back to you in the studio.